Hey guys, what's going on? It's your girl Godly. Now, I know that I haven't brought you a commentary in quite a while. I just honestly haven't had that much to talk about. I know that that's a shocker and all, but it is what it is. Now that the Titanfall beta is over, I wanted to bring you my thoughts, my opinions, give you my two cents. Now, I didn't get a chance to play the beta. I currently don't have an Xbox One and just not a big fan of PC gaming, so I didn't get a chance to play. But, like everybody else in the community, I watched probably 50 to 100 videos on Titanfall. And that makes me a fucking expert, so let's go. The thing that I kept seeing is Titanfall going to be the COD killer. Now, two problems that I have with that. First of all, I don't want another Call of Duty. I'm tired of people comparing it. We don't need another Call of Duty. If we want another Call of Duty, that's pretty simple. Let's just wait until November and get another Call of Duty. I want something new, something different, something fresh. I don't want another Call of Duty. Now, don't get me wrong. I've always been a Call of Duty fan. I defended Call of Duty against Battlefield and especially against Halo. I love Call of Duty. Like I told you before, I was playing Call of Duty 2 when Call of Duty 2 was hot. So I'm an old school Call of Duty fan and I've always defended them. I love the franchise. I just don't want another Call of Duty. I mean, I do want another Call of Duty, but just not with this game. You know, I want something new and something different. And I find it, I find it funny that people are constantly, well, we want something new. But they bitch and moan and groan that it's different. You know what I'm saying? Like, what exactly is the community wanting? Are they wanting another Call of Duty? It doesn't just go with this. It also, let's take the Xbox One. People were so pissed off, myself included, about the DMR. Finally, they took away the DMR. Now, this was back whenever they first released the promo, the news, what have you. I don't know. What was individuals wanting? Were they wanting a second generation Xbox 360? I don't know. Like I said, I didn't get a chance to get the Xbox One. One of two reasons is money. You know, adult status. I didn't have money. The second thing, I got an Xbox 360 when it was released. And with the Xbox 360, it was rushed. Now we're talking about years ago, but it was rushed. I went through three Xbox 360s and I sent all of them in because of the ring of death. They were rushed, rushed, rushed. So I kind of just sat back with the Xbox one. I've been there. I've done that. And I'm definitely one of those people that just kind of sit back. I keep my mouth shut and I keep my eyes open and I'm glad I did. For those of y'all who don't know, Xbox One will have a Titanfall edition. So I guess it kind of worked out in my favor. I guess it pays to not pay sometimes. <laughs> Anyways, but they are going to have a Titanfall edition. Like I said, I'm glad that I waited. Not only for money reasons, but because I went through the whole 360 thing. And I did not want to be a part of that. We all know from 360 to Call of Duty and so many other products so many things are always so rushed so like i said i'm glad that i waited also a little bit of other news for you guys march the 11th the day that titanfall is set to be released twitch broadcasting is coming to xbox one now if that's a coincidence hmm i don't even know also i was seeing that um microsoft has lowered the price of the xbox one so like i said i guess it pays for me because I don't have money. <laughs> you know, I did plan on getting the Xbox One between now and the time that Titanfall was released. So I guess it's just going to be a bundle. And I hopefully, you know, I don't know. Hopefully it all works out for me. Um, but like I said, I just, I didn't get a chance to get the Xbox One. I'm glad that I waited. I'm excited about the Xbox One Titanfall edition. And I'm excited about Titanfall. Like I said, I don't want another Call of Duty. Um... If that's the case, then I could just wait until November. Uh, like I Hello? said, I get so tired of people wanting something new, yet they bitch and complain that it's know. different. You know? So, like I said, I'm waiting. 
Um, I'm excited to play it. I didn't get a chance to play the beta. Um, I'm calling it now. <laughs> you know, game of the year. I, I believe that it's going to be, that Titanfall is going to be the game of the year. Another thing with the, you know, is Titanfall going to be the COD killer? Listen, Call of Duty Ghosts is so bad that it doesn't need another game to bring it down. Call of Duty is doing that on its own, you know? So... I don't think that it needs another game, whether it's Titanfall or whether it's any other game, you know. I don't think that they need any help. They are doing fine by themselves, you know. They're on a downhill, just a downhill slide right now. Um, I love Call of Duty. I love the franchise, but I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I think that Ghost has just, oh, I don't know. That's another commentary in and of itself. So, <laughs> like I said, I don't think that um, Titanfall or any other game is going to be a COD killer. You know, Call of Duty is doing that, doing a great job on their own. So, anyways, guys, I just wanted to give you a little bit of news, a little bit of info if you guys haven't seen it. Um, and just kind of talk about my thoughts and opinions and give you my two cents regarding Titanfall and just all the other good stuff. So, that's what I got for you guys. Till next time, peace out.